Police have released video stills that show three alleged suspects in the killing of General Hospital actor Johnny Wachter. Wachter, 37, was fatally shot in May after he interrupted a catalytic converter theft on his car in downtown Los Angeles. The actor played Brando Corbin on the long-running daytime soap opera. In one of the stills, three suspects could be seen near a black Infiniti Q50 sedan that police said was used to flee the scene of the killing. The suspects cannot be clearly seen, but police said the suspect who shot Wachter has a tattoo above the left eye and on the right cheek. The Los Angeles Police Department is asking for the public's help with identifying the three suspects. Wachter was headed to his car with a co-worker early morning on May 25th after working a night shift at Level 8 in downtown Los Angeles. They approached men seen near his car, thinking it was possibly being towed. Three individuals had the actor's car raised up with a floor jack and were in the process of stealing the catalytic converter, police said in a news release. His co-worker, Anita Joy, said in an Instagram post that Wachter kept his cool as he always did, simply stating that it was his car and for them to leave. Hands open to his sides in peace. A shot rang out. Joy said Wachter was between her and the person who shot him. Based on witness statements, Wachter was shot, without provocation, police said. Officers responded to the 1200, block of Hope Street at around 3.25 a.m. and found Wachter with an apparent gunshot wound. Emergency personnel responded to the scene and transported him to a hospital, where he was pronounced dead. Wachter, who hailed from Charleston, South Carolina, always wanted to be an actor, his mother previously told NBC News. He made that dream a reality making his TV debut on Lifetime's West Wives, and went on to appear in 164 episodes of General Hospital. He also appeared on television's Westworld and as a voice in the video game Call of Duty. Vanguard, according to the Internet Movie Database. The Los Angeles Police Department released a chilling update in the investigation of General Hospital alum Johnny Wachter's death. Authorities have asked for help identifying three suspects. ABC News reported that the LAPD released an image with the suspects. The actor, who portrayed Brando Corbin on the ABC soap from 2020 to 2022, was shot and killed in the early morning hours of May 25th after a confrontation over thieves stealing the catalytic converter from his car. Police released a surveillance photo of the three people they suspect were involved and the vehicle they fled the scene in. Authorities identified the vehicle as a stolen 2018 black Infiniti Q50 sedan with a tan interior. Wachter was shot in downtown L.A. near Hope Street and Pico Boulevard after leaving a shift bartending at Level 8 in the area. He reportedly stood in between the shooters and a colleague who walked out with him. Police said the suspected shooter has a tattoo above his left eye and one on his right cheek, CBS News Los Angeles reported. Since the actor's death, there have been rallies urging action in his case. Wachter's mother, Scarlett Wachter, said in a statement, there are not enough words to tell what a beautiful soul he was. He was a kind, loving son and brother. He lived life to the fullest. He set goals and went after them. There is a very large hole in our hearts and lives. Wachter's godmother set up a GoFundMe to help his family in the wake of his murder. So far, it has raised $142,782 raised of its $200,000 goal. If you have any information about this investigation, call Central Bureau Homicide Detectives Howarth at 213-996, 4143 and Bobadilla at 213-996-4173. After hours, ask for Central Area Watch Commander. Police have released photos of the three male suspects in General Hospital star Johnny Wachter's shooting death. Wachter, 37, was shot in downtown Los Angeles around 3.25 a.m. on June 25th while he was walking back to his car after a shift as a bartender.
he happened upon three men who had lifted his 2018 Infiniti Q50 with a floor jack and were attempting to take his catalytic converter. The actor was shot in the chest without provocation after he confronted the men and the suspects fled the scene in his stolen car. The actor was transported to the hospital where he died. Photos released by Police Sunday show the three suspects standing around Wachter's car with the doors open. Two of the men are wearing light-colored sweatshirts, and the third is wearing a black hoodie. Another photo shows the car with its lights on, presumably leaving the area. The only physical description of the suspects provided by police was that suspect one has a tattoo above the left eye and on the right cheek. Anyone with information on the suspects in Wachter's death should contact the Central Bureau Homicide Detective Number 37636 at 213-996 for 143 and Detective Bobadilla at 213-996-4173. Public members can also leave an anonymous tip with Crime Stoppers at 1-800-222-TIPS. The Los Angeles Police Department is looking for help in identifying the killers of General Hospital actor Johnny Wachter and, for the first time, has released surveillance photos of the suspects. Wachter, who portrayed Brando Corbin on General Hospital from 2020 until 2022, was fatally shot during a suspected attempted robbery in Los Angeles on Saturday, May 25th. He was said to be walking back to his car after a late-night shift at a bar in downtown when he encountered three men attempting to steal the catalytic converter from his car. The soap star did not try to stop the suspects, but was shot before they fled the scene. Authorities arrived shortly after 3 a.m. Pacific time, per the Los Angeles Police Department, and Wachter was later pronounced dead at the hospital. Police have been investigating the murder since May, but have yet to identify the suspects. Now, the LAPD has publicly released a surveillance camera photo, which shows the three alleged gunmen and their getaway vehicle. Two of the men are wearing gray-colored hoodies and the other is seen in a black hoodie. According to the LAPD, the man who pulled the trigger, identified as Suspect One, has a tattoo above his left eye and on his right cheek. The suspects were said to have fled north on Hope Street in a stolen 2018 black four-door Infiniti Q50 with a tan interior. Police are urging anyone with information surrounding Wachter's murder to contact LAPD Central Bureau Homicide Detectives Howarth and Bobadilla by calling 213-996-4143. After business hours and on weekends, calls should be directed to the Central Area Watch Commander. While best known for his role on General Hospital, Wachter also had parts in the Lifetime show.